Okay, we're live. Ta-da! How you doing, folks? Uh, doing another show. Last week I couldn't do it. I was uh, I was really sick. I mean, seriously ill. Uh, I had the night before. I had some all-time badass chills and a fever. And uh, Thursday I wound up. Uh, in the emergency room uh, getting checked out fortunately I'm okay but that was one scary experience so uh, anyway so I'm glad uh, whoever's here is here and uh, this is uh, I don't know I've probably done over a hundred of these things I don't keep count of them but every Thursday I do it um, and uh, I'm gonna be playing a full set tonight and uh, there's a donation tab up there. Uh, please, if you can, uh, donate. We're still not out of the woods with this COVID thing, and I've had gigs rescheduled or canceled, uh, and it's hard to even get gigs because there's a lot of people on the fence right now. So anything you can donate would be really appreciated, but I'm giving you gifts back. So uh, if you click on that um, donor box link up there, you'll see what I'm giving back to you in return to, for your donations. So, I had uh, some requests for this one, and I think I'm going to uh, play it. So here we go. Uh, hey George, it's good to see you too. Well, at least it's good that you're here. Uh, thanks buddy. So I'm gonna do, uh, ah, my man George is here. I'm gonna do a tune that, uh, it's my version of a song called I Know You Rider. Thank you. 
light on a northbound train. Wish I was a headlight on a northbound train. Yes, I know you're right, I'm gonna miss me when I'm gone I know you're right, I'm gonna miss me when I'm gone You're gonna miss your daddy from rolling Miss your daddy from rolling Miss your daddy from rolling in your arms Thanks, Keith. Digo Master. Uh, yeah, I am actually going to be in Vermont. Check out my website. The first weekend of November, I'm going to be in Rutland, Vermont. There's going to be a theater. There's a theater there. I'm going to be playing that theater. It's a small little theater, but it's really uh, nice. It's really intimate. So I'll be down there. Uh, it's just a one day and then I'm going down into Massachusetts and then down into New York and then home so if you can uh, just check out my website for details okay uh, hey Phil yeah uh, <laughs> come on up and say hi all right hi Holly it's good to uh, good to see you and I know Ethan's here too uh, let's see if I can get all the comments sometimes I can't get all the comments here but uh, I'm glad folks are here. So I'm going to do a tune now. This is a, a Blind Lemon Jefferson tune. It's one of my favorite uh, Blind Lemon Jefferson tunes uh, that I like a whole lot. Uh, it's called uh, The Bad Luck Blues. probably gambling and he lost all his money now he doesn't even have clothes when I want to go home I ain't got sufficient clothes dump on my bad luck soul I want to go home ain't got sufficient clothes yeah I'm, I'm talking about sufficient man I, I, I ain't got any I want to go home and I ain't got sufficient clothes I bet all my money and I lost it, yeah, man. Doggone my bad luck soul. I bet all of my money. Doggone my bad luck soul. Yeah, playing these cards, I lost everything I had. I want to go home, but I ain't.
Baby, you catch the cake. And, and I'm gonna catch the Santa Fe. Dog on my bad luck, so you catch the cake. I'm gonna catch the Santa Fe. Yeah, I'm talking about the Cape Man. I'm talking about the, the Santa Fe. And I tell you, babe, I'm gonna meet you in Dallas someday. You know the woman I love? She's standing about five feet from the ground. The woman I love? Standing five feet from the ground. Yeah, talking five feet from the ground, man. She ain't no hand me down. Sugar, I haven't seen her in two weeks in a day. Dog on my bad luck, so haven't seen my sugar in two weeks in a day. Yet I'm talking two weeks, baby, two weeks in a day. I'm so down. I don't know what I'm gonna do today. Anyway, that's my version of. A little bit of the uh, Blind Lemon Jefferson's tune and uh, hey Chris uh, what guitar playing uh, Chris this is a Huss and Dalton uh, mini jumbo cutaway uh, this was once owned by um, oh yeah <laughs> I can't <laughs> forget me oh, man I can't even remember somebody will have to remind me it's late and I can't remember it uh, but uh, at any rate, uh, oh, that's embarrassing. Uh, she's a big song singer songwriter too, and I bought it um, in a little store where uh, she had it on consignment. Carpenter was her last name. Anyway, uh, I'm going to keep this going, folks. Uh, this is going to be Barry. Yeah, uh, saw your show on the calendar. That's right. Barry Kassendorf runs this really nice house concert thing. Um, in uh, Massachusetts. It's up on my website. Um, it's Lakeview House Concerts. So I'm going to be there in the first weekend of November. Thank you, Barry, very much. It'll be really cool to play some of your guitars as well. You know. Anyway, I'm going to take this, uh, do a tune that I love doing. Uh, this is an instrumental I put together, but really I didn't. It's a compilation of one of the greatest ragtime uh, acoustic guitar players, uh, I think, ever. Uh, this guy was named Blind Blake. His name was Arthur Blake, and uh, he he put together. I took some of his really cool tunes, and I kind of put them all together. Uh, as a matter of fact, uh, the, with the donation thing, uh, I think it's like twenty dollars, uh, which is a discount. Um, you can choose any pack of lessons, and I have a whole thing on Blind Blake under the hood. So I really, we really get into what Blind Blake was doing. So if you guitar players out there, you may be interested in that. Uh, anyway, here we go.
Wildwood at Wildwood Flower in Rochester. Jake is an instrument. Yeah, I, I've heard of Jake. Yeah, yeah, sure. I think I may have. Mary Chapin Carpenter. Thanks, George. That's who owned this guitar. Uh, yep. <laughs> I can't believe I couldn't remember a first name. My goodness. Well, speaking of cool guitars, I got something to show you. Only 34 of these guitars were ever made. Uh, this is a Del Arte instrument, a 12 string guitar. Uh, it was originally, it looked like Lead Belly's guitar, but I had some modifications. It had a tail piece coming out to here, but um, Mike Halver, a great luthier, wonderful luthier, um, he uh, decided, he thought it was best, to uh, put in a uh, uh, nice bridge right here instead of a tailpiece down here, which puts more pressure on the top and brings out more sound. And then there was too much lumber inside this thing, way too much bracing. So he, he pulled out the back and he, he took that out and he put in... Uh, he just put in the basic bracing that this needs, and this thing, man, this thing, this thing can really sing, uh, and you'll see what I mean by that. You know, it's uh, Ethan. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah. You listen to that, right? Let me bring down volume a little bit. Yeah. So I'm gonna do a Blind Willie McTell tune broke down engine.
Yeah, I say now, Lord, Lordy, Lord. Big enough, yeah. I hear that. I hear that, even. Ethan. Um, this is uh, this next tune is a tune that was done by Lead Belly, Huddy Leadbetter. Um, he wrote it because, as he claimed, he was a lead boy for Blind Lemon Jefferson. He was a little younger than Blind Lemon Jefferson, and uh, Blind Lemon Jefferson being blind. Most of the time, he had somebody lead him around. Lightning Hopkins claimed to be doing that. Wouldn't doubt it. And uh, so did uh, Lead Belly. They used to play sometimes on this train. They used to take the seats, you know, move one seat like this so the two seats would face each other, see? Sit down like that. You could do that with those old trains. I remember the trains like that. And they used to face each other and they used to play in the colored people's car, okay? That's what they call it. And it was just all the black people down in there. And of course, the conductor would come by and they didn't charge these guys anything because the customers would love to sit there and listen to these two guys play. And they went from Waco, uh, Dallas, and Silver City. It was just this, this little triangle. That's what they did. And, uh, you know, the funny thing is, is they saved up enough money between the two of them to buy a car. That's right. And they were arguing over who should drive it. Okay. I mean, uh, Lemon Jefferson turned around and said he should drive it. You know, he put in most of the money, it seems. Leadbelly turns around and says, well, I should drive it. Lemon Jefferson said, no, you can't because, you know, you drink too much. Leadbelly turned around and he said, yeah, but you're blind. So guess who wound up driving the car? So this is a tune called Silver City Bound. Uh, it's one of my favorite tunes to play. I really like this tune a whole lot. Silver City Bound Silver City Bound Tell my baby I'm Silver City bound. Me and Blind Lemon gonna head on down. Silver City bound, Silver City bound. Tell my baby I'm Silver 
city bound Me and blind them men Gonna head on down Blind them men Baby He was a blind man Blind them men Baby Yeah, he was a blind man Try it, Ethan. Silver City Bound. Well, I'm going to go into uh, drop tuning, dropping down this, uh, my, my tuning anyway. Uh, I think I got this tuned uh, with the 12-string. What I usually do with this one is I, I tune it down a whole step. Uh, sometimes people tune it down even lower. I guess I could do that. And I use medium gauge strings, so I need to tune it down a little bit. I don't want to put too much stress on the, uh, what do you call it, on the top, and it'll do something like that. So I'm going to do this one tune for you. Uh, go back to Blind Willie McTell right now, and I'm going to do this one tune called Statesboro Blues. Now, the Allman Brothers did it, but they did it in a whole different way, so I'm going to do it the way McTell. Mama, turn your lamp down low. Yet yeah, I said, baby, wake up, Mama, turn your lamp down low. Where do you get the nerve to turn me from your door? You're mighty mean woman to treat me this old way. Yeah, the mighty old woman to treat me this old way. I'm leaving, and you know I'm leaving today. My mama left me reckless, my daddy let me run wild. My mama died and left me reckless And my daddy just let me run wild I ain't good looking But I'm some sweet angel's child Yeah, sister, tell your brother Brother, tell your nephew Nephew, tell your cousin Tell him, cut your uncle I'm going to the country And baby, don't you worry can't make it, <laughs> your sister said she'll go, Thank you. 
the banner did not stop. You wanna hear the color five man when he got the ball out of the reach reach over my Hand me my traveling shoe. Don't you know my back? I said, don't you know my back? I got them old stats rolled through. Everybody I know has your state's ball. You know, I looked in the corner, and my grandma, she had them too. Your state's borough blues. Thanks, Barry. Thanks a whole lot. Well, now we're going to completely change everything around. I, I love taking, well, this is a long time ago. I put this together, I think, when I was about 19. I still play it, but I hardly play it. But now I'm going to play it. It's, I took three fiddle tunes and I put them together. Uh, and uh, here we go. Let's see if we can do this one. fiddle tune for you. Ah. Ethan, you turn it to, to A, standard, or B, 
Okay. Low, I guess, right? Really low. Uh, I'm going to do a Big Bill Brunsy number. Uh, this is uh, at least the way I like doing it. It's called Texas Tornado. I like doing this real slow. <laughs> My baby, she's a Texas tornado And she howls just like the wind My baby, she's a Texas tornado And she howls just like the wind She blow your house down All you gotta do is ask her where you been. Her eyes flash like lightning. She thunder when she walk. She grab hold of a man. Let him go. He can't even talk. My baby's a Texas tornado. And she howls just like the wind. She blow your house down And all you gotta do is ask her Where you been? When the ground starts shaking And the sky turning black I'm on my knees praying, man Cause I know maybe she coming back She's a Texas Tony She howled just like the wind She blow your house down And all you gotta do is ask her where you've been Such a drop of gin. She don't drink no beer. She doesn't touch a drop of gin. But when she smokes that local weed, you better not ask her, baby, baby, where you been? Flash like lightning, she thunder when she walks. Grab hold of a man, let him. He can't even talk. 
talk of babies in Texas, don't you? And she howled just like the wind. She blow your house down. And all you gotta do is say, baby, 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 where you been? doing those slow ones well folks I hope you're liking this so far I'm gonna do one more and uh, again this is my pleasure to do this do this once a week it keeps my chops up and uh, I'm always trying to come up with a dig a song out from my old repertoire and throw it in there uh, I had a request for this one this is my um, this is my uh, oh, let me get this out of here you know, cell phones wreak havoc on guitar amps. I learned that the hard way by leaving my cell phone on top of an amplifier at a concert. <laughs> Even the sound man didn't know what was going on. All right, folks, I'm going to do my last one, if you can. Uh, please, uh, if you can, please send a donation. It would really be appreciated. I'm going to do my arrangement of Sweet Georgia Brown. <laughs> enjoyed that one that was my sweet little Georgia Brown oh thanks thanks a lot Howard thanks Doug uh, I appreciate I appreciate your uh, comments it makes me me feel good sharing this music 
um, and hopefully 2022 will be a better year. I'm already starting to book some gigs, and let's just hope we get out of the woods, all right? Uh, but I do have gigs coming up. You can always check my calendar. It's littletobywalker.com. Uh, there's all kinds of cool stuff on that. Uh, you can check it out. Um, and uh, again, if you can send a donation, I will be sending you back some cool things. Just check out the donation, the donor box link, and you're going to see what I'm going to be sending you. You can choose all kinds of lessons from my guitar lesson website, which is uh, tobywalkerslessons.com. I teach all this stuff. So anyway, folks, um, thanks so much. It was really good to hear from some of my friends uh, some folks uh, I've never met and other people, uh, George, my friend George Herman, that's probably my oldest friend uh, around. So that's really kind of cool. All right, folks, thank you very much. I appreciate you coming out. And uh, next Thursday, I do it all over again. All right, folks, take care and uh, stay safe.